Thank you for joining me here today at Southwest Arkansas's famous Crater of Diamonds State Park. We're going to find out what the diamonds look like that have been, been found here recently, uh, what size they are, what color they are. They have white or clear yellow and brown diamonds here. Admission is just $15 for ages 13 and up. Children uh, 12 and under are less or free. You can see the, oh look, there's the Aspen Diamond, 2.95 carat brown. Found September 1st, 2023 by a seven-year-old girl on her birthday. On Tuesday, April 16th, the Wright City, Missouri guest registered a 62-point white diamond. Now that's a good size diamond. The average found here is uh, 20 points, so that's over three times larger than the average bear. On uh, Tuesday, April 16th, the Murfreesboro, Arkansas guest registered a nine-point white diamond. That's probably David Anderson. He's found well over 700 diamonds here. On Tuesday, April 16th, a Wiggins, Mississippi guest registered a five-point yellow. Oh, look at that, 44-point white in the upper right. That's a gorgeous diamond. That is a lovely picture of it. Showed the beautiful shape. On Wednesday, April 17th, a Denham Springs, Louisiana guest registered a two-point white diamond. Now, there's 100 points of weight per carat. So a two point is one fiftieth of a carat. Oh, there's a two point white. That may well be it. There's a 22 point white. So it's over a fifth of a carat. On Wednesday, April 17th, a Renton, Washington guest registered a 22 point white diamond, the one we were just talking about, the one you just saw. On Wednesday, April 17th, a Jacksonville, Arkansas guest registered a one point white diamond. Jacksonville is kind of a suburb of Little Rock. There's the Bud Diamond, 3.29 karat brown. David Anderson found it. I was here that day, March 4th, last year, when he found it. On Thursday, April 18th, an Angleton, Texas guest registered a two-point white diamond. There was a picture of a two-point white there. Well, there's another two-point white. Uh, on Thursday, April 18th, a Grapevine, Texas guest registered a three-point white diamond. Uh, Grapevine is kind of a suburb of the greater Dallas-Fort Worth area off by uh, DW, the airport. The, uh, on Thursday, April 18th, a Grapevine Texas guest registered a two-point white. Look at that beautiful 44-point white. I love the shape, the color. It's kind of an off-white. On Friday, April 19th, a Murfreesboro, Arkansas guest registered a 44-point white diamond. Well, that's a good one. That was that one we saw. Total diamonds found so far this year, they're not saying, but it's uh, well over 238. I'm, oh, 222 as of April 19th. Okay. We're uh, over that now. <clears throat> this is their latest news. Since this site became a state park in 1972, well, there's a 2.85 carat brown. Uh, 36,088 diamonds have been found since this site became a state park 52 years ago. Well, I think we just about have all the information on the recent diamond finds. I thank you for joining me. Please subscribe to our page, Genuine Diamonds in AR, and uh, like our videos. Please watch them and comment. And uh, I, I want to say one more thing about this 62 point white diamond. So um, that's almost two thirds of a carat. So uh, that, is, that is a good size. Um, a friend of mine just registered a 60-point white. Uh, he had dug, I think, 130 buckets and found nothing. And then he found that one. And so it kind of made up for all the fruitless labor. <laughs>